good. This is Ramen on Wheels, AKA The Row Mobile. And I'm gonna be doing something different today. Today is the new year or it's the start of the new year. So why not do something new? Which is why I'm gonna be installing LED lights. Let's get it. So I bought this pack of LED lights right here from Amazon, was it? And it costs maybe like eight bucks. It's the portable kind, not the kind that you have to stick. Not the kind that you have to stick into the wall. I didn't drop that. Yeah. Uh, and yeah, I'm gonna attach them. It's, uh, what is this, six feet, six feet? So yeah, I'm gonna just attach them, see how they look. Uh, I did more than just get the LED lights. I also got, because I'm looking at this, and it doesn't seem like it's gonna be all that sticky. Like it comes with like a, okay, it comes with a remote. It comes with a remote. Uh, it's supposed to have all these different colors on it. On, off, green, blue, purple, blah, 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 flash, uh, multicolor. And then it comes with uh, this rail. Well, it comes with the battery pouch right here. You're supposed to stick Is that AAA? Yes. Yeah. AAA batteries in there. Uh, and then you attach this end to the actual light strip, which is right here. If I can undo that. So yeah, it comes with this LED strip right here. And these are the lights. Where you, you see where the gold is? That gold, the little four circles with the gold. It looks like a line going through them. Uh, if, you're, well, if it was too long and if you wanted to cut it, that's where you would cut it at. Uh, so if I only wanted like a two feet long cord, I would cut it like right there in that strip and then just this end would light up. Uh, if you want to reattach it, you couldn't. Or if there's probably a way you could, but uh, I ain't that high tech, so. Okay, so you wouldn't pull this completely off because this is not sticky at all. Uh, it's this part you need to undo. Like these two are like caught on here pretty well. It's this this part, which is a double-sided tape at the same time. It's still, it's sticky, but it's not as sticky as I would want it to be. So with that being said, I also bought this scotch tape velcro which actually makes it removable it's easy to remove you have the soft furry end and you have the sticky end so this is how oh you see this is how i'm going to be attaching okay pull one of those okay uh, put it back off the other side so these these will stick for sure so so i'm going to be putting it along the frame going around the other end so uh, yeah, let's 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 do that. Okay, now that I have double A, so my mistake is not double A, it's not triple A, it's double A. Some double A batteries. We'll be placing them in there. And let me put this attached this to the scooter really quick. And yeah. So I want the lights to kind of be just right here underneath here and just go around the other way. Nothing extravagant. So I'm going to write down, I have a little rubbing alcohol on this uh, towel. I'm just gonna write down this so it can actually stick. Just go on the other side. I want this to wrap around this way. We'll put this on this end. We'll bring this under here. So on this end, I want this to come as far as about right here. That way when I do attach it, I can kind of hide this right behind here. This is the battery pack. So we're gonna put this about right here. Stretch this around and see how that goes. First thing is first, I'm gonna take the soft part of the fasteners and just place them along here where I want this to be. So it's gonna be this one I'm gonna put on the inside, so I'm gonna put it backwards like that. Where you can't see it because it's gonna the battery is gonna go on the inside like right there. And then I'm just gonna bring it down the line. 
just gonna put this under here. And then I'm gonna do the other side as well. So I'm gonna take it, since it starts here, this is where my battery pack is gonna be. So what I'm gonna do, place this, the scratchy end on this side of the battery pack, like that, and then I'm going to attach it to that. And voila, could you see that? Attached it under here, see? Just like so. So now it's hidden from the world. And then the next one starts here. I put another one there. So I'm gonna take this, attach it here to this end, like so. Go for that one, and it's right there. And that's what I'm just gonna do. I'm gonna just go around where did I put the other one? I'll put the other one here. The other one is here, so I'm going to, I don't want this to interfere with my kickstand. So we're gonna put it here. I'm gonna try to do a little of this. Pull off some of that. So let me just do a combination of both just for that extra stickiness. Let's have it turn. Okay. Okay, now that this end is attached, we're gonna move on to the other side. Now that it's on there, it's not on there the best, but I mean, this is just to test this out, to see what that looks like. Uh, we're gonna plug it in. We're going to plug it in now. Okay, it's plugged in. Push that back to the side. And there are the lights. I'm pretty sure it shows better at night. I am going to also show you guys the lights at night, so don't worry about that. But that's them. See so yeah, the remote, I've tested out the remote and the remote doesn't seem to like want to work at all. Like nothing happens with the remote. Now I'll remind you this was like a cheap seven, eight dollar thing. It's, so it's stuck on the color blue slash purple now when I first plugged it in it was flashing different colors it was going from like red blue green yellow and then I pressed one color which is the color you see now and uh, it, it's not doing anything after that so well, is this a one-time use remote you better get it right on the color you want the first time otherwise you're stuck with that so yeah it's not changing colors let me see if I can manipulate it some kind of how to change colors Just to let you guys know, I did get the colors to change later on. Button, you see? I was able to get the colors to change. 
So that's pretty cool. Yep, rainbow colors. So yeah guys, that was me adding LED strips to the scooter, also known as a ramen, also known as the Romobile. If you guys like video like this, well let me know in the comment section below. And if you guys have any other ideas about like ways you can like pimp out your scooter, because you know I've done uh, I've sticker bonded my scooter before, I've plastic dipped my scooter before, and now I threw on some LED lights. Uh, anything like to switch up the look of the scooter, let me know if you guys have ideas, cute little uh, do-it-yourself projects. I would love to do those and share with you guys. And uh, thank you for watching Ramen on Wheels. If you like this video, please give it a like. And if you want to subscribe, subscribe. If you want to subscribe, you know, do you be a part of the Roll Crew. And I will see you guys later. Deuces.